Hello. Hello. Who are you? Nice to meet you. What is your nice name? Nice to meet you. What is your name, sir? Carlo. Your name is, your name is, your name is what? Carlo. Ka Ka you mean Caleb? Uh, Carlo. <laughs> Callan? What? Callum. Callum. Oh, Colin. Gotcha. Well, I'd like to introduce you <laughs> to my two friends, Law and Order. You can't run from the law. You can't hide from the order. Get back here. Get back here. Look, you're already injured. I might as well put you out of your misery. Come here. There's no point in living. Come here. Just give in to the hate. Alright, fine. We'll be friends here. Yeah. Come here. We can travel this land together. I'm serious. Come here. We'll start over. Hi. My name's Lieutenant Steve. Yeah, that's right. You heard of me. Come here. Look, your shirt's already red, okay? I don't care if I stained it with blood. No one will see the stain. Come here! Ooh, Clorox. You can't run from me. You know that, right? Come here. Come here. Let's, let's, let's start over. Let's start over. No, seriously. I'm Lieutenant Steve. Have you not heard of me? Colin. Colin. Listen. My man. If I wanted to kill you, you'd be dead already, okay? Look. This is just how I make friends. It's like an initiation process. You know, I just punch him in the shoulder. Hey, bud. Come there. You know I'm gaining on you, right? I don't know if it's because your internet connection sucks, or if I'm just a beast. But I'm running faster than you. I'm not trying to kill you. Uh, somebody else talking. Come here. Looking back, you know I'm behind you. You don't have to keep looking back. I'm always gonna be behind you if you decide to stop. You feel my breath on the, the nape of your neck. Are you gonna starve before I beat you to death? Is that how this is gonna go? Listen, I just wanna talk. You seem like a nice guy. Let's start over. Free from. Seriously, where are you from? You sounded like you were from the UK. But the question is, what part of the UK? I know it's going to get to sound like Irish. Oh, you sounded like an Irishman, right? You sounded super, super Irish. You're an Irishman, right? Yeah? I love Guinness. Come here. Do you, do you realize how much of your time you're wasting right now? Because you're running across the map, and then I'm going to kill you. Yes, the Irish fan. That's why I'm going to get this. Come here. I I don't know if you value your time, but the more you run, the less likely I am to keep you alive. Every step that you make, until the pint of blood I'm going to beat out of you. I got all day, man. I'm gonna hunt you down. I'll be right behind you. You know what? You're fucking five hours ahead of me. Okay? So, it is 10.48 p.m. for you. It is 5.48 for me, and I'm chasing you. Let's do this. Road. We're already past Brightmoor, it's running east on the road past Brightmoor. It's into the end of the map soon. He just keeps running and looking back now. I don't know where he plans on going, but he's just gonna die. At my hand. I punched him. Again. See, I told you I just wanted to be friends. I was trying to shake your hand. You don't know the secret handshake? Let's make a fist and kind of like twist your elbow around a little bit. I, I kind of slipped, sorry. It's been a while. Colin, come here. Colin. You are the most unentertaining prey I've ever had. You think 
because you're Irish. Call in. Look, I, th I feel like we're getting off on the wrong foot here. I think we're going to be best friends. You know, the worst of enemies usually become the best of friends, Colin. We overcome our differences. We can, have, we can have a happily ever after in this nice base of yours that looks like a fucking torture jail. Let me introduce you to a little something called Wolf Rugs, okay? It'll definitely make this place a lot cozier. Oh, so you think the woods are your friend? Merely adopted the woods. I was born in it. <laughs> Come here. Smell your fear. Can't hide. Where do you think you're going? You don't even know who I am. You're about to run into the border of the map. You're welcome for the pro tip. Yes, try to swim, I dare you. Swim. Colin, you're not being reasonable, and I'm a reasonable man. We talk this out like gentlemen. Are you trying to backtrack? Come on, give us freaking fuck you. You just gave me, you just gave me yardage. I'm closer to you. Play rugby, fucking UK. But you play rugby, you should know that double track is a fuck. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Have you watched Predator? You're Arnold Schwarzenegger, I'm the Predator. Wait a second, that means I'm gonna lose, right? He's in the Predator too, fuckface. You're a brat. Come here. You cannot run from me. Do you understand that you're wasting your own time? Either you make friends with me, or I'll brutally kill you by the side of this river. Okay, I see you being reasonable. You're slowing down now. Good. Let's start over. So I'm a lieutenant. I don't know about you, but I ate a shit ton of food and drink right before hunting me down, so... I'm not even breaking a sweat. I haven't even broken a sweat yet, bro. I'm just getting warmed up. <laughs> God, fucking river west of Brightmore. We just went by the border of the map, running back toward Brightmore. Stop looking back. You know I'm behind you. Always. I'm always behind you. First, now we're swimming. Swimming right behind him. It's like crisp as day. I can see him in the water. I'm actually swimming on top of him. He cannot escape from me. Might drown. He actually might drown. I'm going for air. Well, try to block him. Shit, shit, shit. Where'd he go? Here he is. I got air. He didn't. Damn, dude. He must be drowning. He's on land. You chase him. Colin! No, I was in track and field. Ain't nothing gonna stop me, man. I can swim, I can run, I can jump, I can brutalize you. Colin, man, look, I just want a friendly conversation. Is that too much to ask for? This is the longest chase I've ever been on, and I've been in car chases and shit. Colin, 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 come here! Come here! You know, your blood only makes me hungrier, right? 
smell of your blood drawing me near. I'm like a shark and sleep bleed for too long. Ten miles away. Mile away. What is the number again? Because you're one foot away from me. Ah, the border of the map again. Excellent. The place you cannot run to. Now we're by the chain link fence. Oh, by the by the end by, by where uh, James' base is. Now he's running back toward the river. I hope this is entertaining for you, Colin, because we both know how this is going to end. We both. Oh, okay. Look, look. Oh, you're punching now, huh? Oh yeah. Fuck you. Fuck you, man. Let me show you how to kick. Come here. Come here. You know Taekwondo? Come here. If you want to fight, let's fight. You just make it simple. That's the best chance you have at survival right now. It's the best chance you have. I told you not to double back. Oldest trick in the book, man. Come on. Shots? Nope. Nope. Colin, you, you clearly are not a boxer. You're a runner. You know, Colin, this is very simple. I have two hands, you have two hands. I'm the predator, you're the prey. You can easily turn around and start fighting me. There's nothing to stop you from being the predator. That's right, turn around, come here. Nah, 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 don't run away. Okay, come on, that's right, yeah, that's right. Be the predator, come here. Come here, you motherfucker. Don't you value your life? You should fight for it. Fight for your life if you care about it. Come here. Don't just sit down and take my fists. Back to the river again, seriously. I'm gonna outswim you. I'm gonna outswim you, I'm gonna outrun you, I'm gonna outbox you, I'm gonna outkick you. Don't double back. I told you not to double back. That's the oldest trick in the book. Do I really have to teach you how to be a prey? Listen, what you wanna do is you wanna serpentine through the bushes. That'll make it more difficult for me. If I couldn't smell your fear. Which I can. Now try that. Go find the nearest thick bunch of bushes and serpentine through them. That means zigzag through them. It'll make it very hard for me to follow you. Are you swimming again? I'm right behind you. Hey, did you ever see Jaws? It's a shame I can't drown this man with my bare hands. Because I'm like all up on him. Right behind you. That just gave me that just gave me yardage again. I'm even closer now. Come on, fight for your life. Show me how much you care. Show me how much you care. Colin, look, here's my face. Don't you want to punch it? That's right, punch me. Punch me. Kill me. Can you come here and help me beat him to death? Are you watching? Yeah, I'm watching. You can see me? Where are you? Uh, yeah, yeah, I'll just across the river. There, follow me. Colin, I have four more people coming. Either you kill me now and escape my view, or I'm going to have them come gangbang you with their fists. They're going to they're gonna kick you and face curb stomp you. I'm just giving you advice, because I like prey that can fight back. You're just, you're just taking, yeah, a, a bro lapse. <laughs> you're gonna get a bro lapse if you don't take my advice. Are you also running towards Bratmore? Yeah, we just both missed each other with kicks and punches. Dude, guess what? My hunger and thirst is at uh, 93%. What is yours at? That's what I thought. You're getting tired. I can see your morale dropping. Colin, I do not stop. I do not stop. This does not end until you're dead. 
seriously do not give a fuck about real life time or anything. I will chase you until you die. Now, if you jump off the bridge, I'll, I'll be honest with you, I don't think I'll be able to, 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 to find you. He doesn't, he doesn't know how shallow this. He's, he doesn't know how shallow this. Whatever you do, don't jump off the bridge, because it'll end the fun quickly. I won't be able to find you. Colin, no, Colin. No, Colin. Colin, no, don't jump off the bridge, Colin. Colin, don't do it. Don't do it, Colin. Colin, don't do it. Colin, don't do it. I don't want you to give up, Colin. Double back, I told you not to double back. He's on the Brightmore Bridge, he's holding me up on a he's going around on the Brightmore Bridge. I think he's stalling for something. He's going back to Brightmore. Both on the bridge. He jumped, he's gonna die, he's gonna die. Oh shit, he survived! I'm jumping too. We're both alive. I'm following him. You know I'm right behind you, right? I can still smell your fear underwater. You can't wash it off of you. That's right. You better get back on land. I'm only more dangerous in water. You can't punch me in water. Which way did y'all head? We're uh, on the north coast. We're climbing up right now. Oh, I'm right behind him. We're, we're near the base of the bridge to the left of it. Running up to the main road. He's running back to the water. Colin, I see you. Come on, man. Who do you think I am? Some noob? I've been hunting people my whole life, in real life. It's like my hobby. Tell me when you want it to end. And just close your eyes. Just close your eyes. Let me finish it. Tell me when you're done. I will finish you. I'll make it go quick and easy. Put my hands around your throat. <laughs> Come here, Colin. Look, we can bond over this. Here. Fight time. the dude with the blue fear oh my god that's so brutal oh Colin come here you should have done your warm ups you know this is my ally right you stalled for too long now you're outnumbered you should have taken my advice you motherfucker Dude, watch out, don't hit me. Colin, you ready for this? You ready, you ready for it to end? I've been carrying a pistol the whole time. Did you know that? No, I haven't. Are you ready? You ready to get pistoled? That's the thing. I don't want to kill you with a pistol. I want to do it with my bare hands. I wonder what his food and drink is like. <laughs> Come here, listen, I'll introduce you to my friend. We're actually really good people. Shit, good call. Oh shit, he's got a flare gun. Dude, he's got a flare gun. Oh my god, he almost got me! If he had a, if he had a round in there, he might have just died. Oh, what is that for? Is that, is that a flare gun to call for help? Call for uh, helicopter uh, airlift?
all in. Come here. You can join us and be part of our team. We're actually looking for a new young recruit as enth enthusiastic. You gotta show me your resume and show me how many people you've tortured. I Oh, that's good. good! I have the next 12 hours. I will run for 12 hours until you die. But see, but but here's the thing. But, but here's the thing. You're actually talking now, so now your chances of dying are, are slowly decreasing. Because I like a person who's a good conversationalist, who likes to learn about other cultures, and, you know, just get to know you. Talk about your favorite foods and favorite films. I want to know the real Colin. I want to know the real Colin. Not this fake Colin where you're trying to run away from me. Tell me about yourself, Colin. You're probably going to be on my next YouTube video, but uh, I don't know if I can tell you what my channel is if you keep running away. Better record it. Because then people are going to know who the lieutenant is. Lieutenant Steve. That's right. He's going to see how persistent he is. He's never going to stop until you're dead. Like a YouTuber. Yeah, he said he's recording this and he's going to know who I am. <laughs> this shows me and Mindy running after him like fucking maniacs. <laughs> For like 20 minutes. Do you want a cream cake? Cream cake? I would love a cream cake. Come here. Come on, He's gotta be super low. He's gotta be low. My, my drink is really at 33 and my food's at 49. Could've sworn I saw him take a soda out though in the middle of the fight. So. How are you me right now? Cause I'm in beast mode. Colin, Colin, we can be such great friends. Colin, we can be such great friends. Don't you don't even know who I am? I'm clearly a nice guy. You just threatened me with that scary-looking face of yours, and I had to defend myself. But now I see the real Colin behind the face, and you actually seem like a really nice guy. I, I mean, genuinely. I can oh, I can tell I can tell I can tell when someone is trustworthy just by the sound of their voice. The intonations. It's because I don't know I have Parkinson's and my hands just kind of do you know they have convulsions and sometimes they just sort of like lash out at people. You can't blame you can't blame a man for being handicapped, can you? Don't be don't discriminate against the handicap. That's just cruel. There's some shots over here, right? Okay. No, because I'm chasing. Falling behind, I'm actually, I'm actually, I'm actually gaining, gaining distance on you, man. That's because you keep looking. That's because you keep looking behind you. You keep looking behind you. You know that actually slows you down. Also. I think with your weapon out slows you down. That's another bit of advice I'm gonna give you as a, since you're my prey. There you go. Put your come on, put your weapon away. It'll, it'll do you a favor. It'll make you run ever, ever so slightly faster. That's why I haven't taken my pistol out yet to shoot you in the back of the skull. Because I'm having fun and we're playing tag. Oh hell no. Uh, you can technically heal this place. Colin, you know I have 95% uh, health right now. What is your health at? Oh, uh, you bad boy. Your health is not 3%. 
It's not, it's not 3%, don't be silly. You're running so vigorously. Do you realize that if your health really is 3%, you're going to end up dying in about 4 or 5 minutes just because your blood level and your food level is going to decrease? I don't want this to, I don't want it to end that way. Listen, I've got sodas and cans of food on me. We can, we can make this happen. We can make this work. This will be your most legendary survival story of all time. We'll be telling your children about this. <laughs> or, you could just continue running and let Mother Nature take its course. You can fall on the pavement. But you're a survivor, aren't you? You're somebody who has to do what it takes to survive. Even if it means taking a soda from your killer. Or using that flare gun to try to put a, a flare in my skull. I mean, at least do that. I want, I want an honorable fight here. Come, come hither. Colin, you're being a bad boy now. You're trespassing. I'm gaining distance on you again. I don't stop, I told you. I do not stop. Come here. This is going to end right now, Colin. Do you know this? Colin, do you know this is going to end right now? There's no stopping the inevitable. As it comes a point where a man should just turn around and face his fate, face to face. That's right. Turn around. Come here. You have nothing. You have nothing to lose, anyways. Are you gonna Are you gonna go out of this world with your back turned in fear? Or are you gonna go out of this world face to face, facing and laughing death in its face? Come hither. Come here. Leave this world with some honor left. Death cannot take honor from you. Come here. Turn your ass around. Valhalla awaits. So close to killing me. He said he has 3% health and I actually believe him. Colin, how do you want your name to be remembered on YouTube? As a hero? As someone who died nobly, courageously? As someone who just fell flat on their face on the pavement from exhaustion? Chased by the lieutenant to the end of the line? You know, I actually forgive people who turn around and fight nobly and courageously. You'd be surprised how many people have survived only because they were willing to face certain doom just for the sake of the, the last shred of hope in their heart. To those people who, who believe that end up surviving. He just keeps fucking running. <laughs> Colin, come on, man. There's no stopping this. There's no stopping this. Oh shit, there's a mutant near us now. Call it! Don't you have like a friend that can help you or some shit? <laughs> or are you all alone in Pinecrest? Just you, me, and this is Mindy. Yeah. Come here, come here. You can you can watch this shit happen. We're, we're near the fire department. We're near the fire department. His path is unpredictable. Unpredictable. Colin, come here. Oh shit, he might get a weapon in the fire department. Dude, my health hasn't dropped in the longest time. His is probably just staying steady at three percent. It really is three.
Colin, think think about think about you know, like a week from now, you and I are gonna be best friends laughing about this. We're gonna be chuckling, chuckling, I tell you. That's only if you survive, and if we can actually you know share our Steam information and whatnot. But clearly, the way this is going and the decisions that you're making are gonna end up with you either starving starving to death, being beaten to death, or dehydrating. And there's also a chance that someone can run up on us with a gun and just kill both of us. Which would be very entertaining. Okay, see if that <laughs> We're running east. No, no, you have to survive and we have to come to a truce for me to add you on Steam. That's not how this game works. Uh, I'm gonna die. You're not gonna die. Come on. You should know better. You don't know me. I'm Lieutenant Steve. You can even look me up. Lieutenant Steve Apocalypse. LT Steve Apocalypse on YouTube. And if, uh, if you look me up, you'll see that <laughs> although I can be very brutal and make some very brash decisions, I tend to be very forgiving, especially with those that show bravery in the face of death. You, my sir, <laughs> are falling into the former category. But it's never too late. That's my motto. It's never too late, Colin. It's never too late to change your path in life. Uh, 13% water. 13% water? Oh, come on, you'll be fine. Somebody get me water immediately. He's gonna run for the last 13%. I got 14% water. Alright, just follow this one. We're running east along. Yeah, yeah. Is this really the decisions you would make if this were really the apocalypse, Colin? Or would you actually try to make friends and not completely give up on your life? Think about all the not options. Bad. Right now, your your option is to run until you die. That is so bleak. Let's think about all the other options you have. You could try to fight, meet it to death, to the death. You know. You could just drown yourself and put yourself out of your misery and die with some dignity. Or oh, I can die without you killing me. Don't be silly. That you didn't kill me. You don't know that I'm gonna kill you. I have this odd, and a very. I, no, dude, I have a really strange code of conduct. It's a really weird code of conduct for those honorable people who are willing to face face their fate. And I, you know, sometimes I just say, you know what? Have a good day, sir. Have a good day. But those people who run from it, that's the one thing. Like, have you ever been in the face of a predator? And if you run from that predator, they just, they have to hunt you, and they have to kill you. But if you show no fear, that predator will walk away from you. I've actually been in a situation in real life with a tiger. Um, you don't want to ever look it in the eyes. So, so what you gotta do is face your predator face to face. More than half the time, the predator will end up losing fun in the chase. It's not something to teach kids in schools these days. <laughs> I'm, I'm dead, running in a smaller circle. Dead serious, Colin. I'll be coming up faster than, uh, faster than he is. Well, this is it. This is the end of the journey. This is the end of the journey. Well, that was your decision. You made that decision, Colin. Goodbye. <laughs> That was worth every step of the way. He's dead. He's dead. Yeah, I, punch, I punched him to death. Oh shit, there's another person in front of me. Excuse me, sir. What is your name? I swear to God, you better not start running. You motherfucker. I swear to God, you better not start running. I had enough of this shit. Hey, look, let's start over, okay? We had a bad start. What's your name? My name's, my name's Lieutenant Steve. 